Hi to alls. Welcome to Gunja Claus Dollhouse. And this is my first haul and unboxing video. I'm going to bring to you some of my so far very new to this favorite dolls from the Rainbow High collection, but also I have some lol L OMG dolls for you too. And yeah, that's how I say it. So get used to it. Are y'all ready to do this? This is from eBay, and it is um, almost a duplicate set of the LOL OMG Remix dolls. I'm just going to twist that because I have a receptacle. This will all be part of an outfit at some point for somebody. Okay. We've got doll stands. Fabulous. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh my god. I love leopard. A leopard flying V. This is the wet dream of my my youth. What I wouldn't have done for this guitar. IRL. Mm, mm, mm. That's pretty cool. Alright, we should probably play it, right? See if this thing works. Oh, oh, I just love the details. This is so cool. Okay, and this was 2020, so I'm just trying to clock my references so I can be more knowledgeable. It's all knowledgeable. Oh, and another guitar, double neck. Love a double neck. I'm a big classic rock junkie, so yeah. These really hit home for me. Okay, we've got some extra accessories. Bod girl. I guess I can just pull these out, huh? They're mine. <laughs> I'm just like so excited. I don't, I just like want to pull it all at once. Um, these are very cute glasses. Bod girl. And this is a character name for, I think the girl, yes, I know the girl I bought the set for. Bod girl. I bought it for, and she's just sitting on top. So we're going to, oh, and all her shit's right on top. We're just going to do this because, you know, she really hits home for me in the color range and, um, to one thing at a time. I am like just, I can't even, can't even! Oh. Nameplate, little like, oh, with the gloves and the black nails, little stilettos. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh. <laughs> this jacket, vinyl, studded, green. Little cigarette holder, pager, you know, whatever you're living with. Your little, you know, you know, hold your little brooches. I think actually she probably wears it a little up on her knee. Oh, and these, this is really, I mean, the colors, but like, I was like, but does she have these? I think maybe that might need a little, oh, that might have broken. That's fine. I <laughs> Fine. I don't even care. This. Holy shit. That's such, it's like, it goes to show you, you know, there's so many details that you just don't see. And it really makes the, uh, the doll hunt, the doll chase really gratifying for little moments like these where you're just like, yes. You're probably, you know, we're starting off. You're pretty, you're pretty rad. Oh, and let's just, while we're all here. Oops, okay, I'm not gonna futz. Put on her quad, which is so cool. This like studding, this also makes noise. Just really cute. And I believe her drumsticks are in the accessory bag that we that I opened to begin with. 
She could use a little zhuzhing in her hair. I think no one would argue with that. She's gorgeous. I can't wait to get her all dolled up for my collection. Bod girl, you're pretty badass. Um, this is just such a cool bone bone bonus to this remix collection and mostly all doubles. Um, a brat stall, I believe she's Sasha. Um, and oh, 2001, which I believe this doll line came out in 2000. Is that when Bratz happened? Um, I've been trying to catch up on a lot of doll knowledge and YouTube has been really good to me. Um, so yeah, doll YouTube has just been pretty awesome. Um, I believe this is Sasha and actually in my first, um, like thrift store doll haul when I first was like, okay, I'm going to bite the bullet. And I like, couldn't stop thinking about going to the thrift store. And I just, you know, I kind of took most anything in sight and I have since been like, okay, paring some things down. But, um, I did order a bunch of shoes for my Sasha doll that was in this said doll haul and, um, have transformed her to look like Mel B from the Spice Girls. Um, but yeah, she can have a black sporty spice girlfriend, I think. Okay, just tossing me into the the doll reuse bin. Oh, I love the pink sparkle stand. Okay. Jesus. Ay. Okay. So we have jointly wrestled her from a box, from her box. And um, yeah, Miss uh, Vicky is looking good. Um, yeah, I'm not <laughs> like, I noticed that all the, all of her kind of had this like top fuzzing situation and to the point that I mean the girl I got sent did not have enough freckling on her for my satisfaction but uh, also like really had a lot of fuzz going on but um, peace love plastic I believe is his channel he has this really amazeballs um, like cut that he does on Miss Vicky and also um, yeah, he does like a really good curl. Oh yeah, look at all that. And the, there's just like gel up in these curls. So yeah, she gonna get washed. And honestly, she's Death gonna get restyled to be in my collection because yeah we gotta like butch her up I think honestly <laughs> I yeah let's be real about yeah I mean she is just yeah I'm I'm ex I don't know I don't know what's gonna happen to her but it's gonna be fun you getting a makeover girl. Um, I did notice that her stand, uh, thinner little peg thing, um, and also the base theme seems to be a little bit thinner, less embellished. Oh, but still has the rainbow high, which is really nice. I'm always a big fan of reducing the plastic AV. Why I'm saving all this plastic to be repurposed so I can justify my damn doll habit. Okay, Miss Vicky. And and actually, even though it's not super canonical because of her look, because she, the strawberry, and obviously doesn't really look like Posh Spice, AKA 
Vicky B, Victoria Beckham, but I think that's who she's going to become in the head cannon. She's got the obligatory, though no second outfit, which is a travesty. Hate that. I need all the outfits I can get. I don't really care about accessories, although that's cute that it's hinged. Like that. A little makeup palette with a little mirror. Cute. Um, a little cell phone with a case and a little thumb notch. Oops, I put it in the wrong way. How do you can tell I'm not a iPhone user, huh? <laughs> okay, there we go, right? Maybe? Yeah. Bang, bang. Um, her little knockoff Louis Vuitton. Hair dryer, right? Rainbow high print and a cute little sewing machine. Love that. Oh my gosh! That's a fun attention to detail. That feels like um, I was a big American Girl doll collector back in the OG days um, when Addie first came out. And I was obsessed with her like oil lantern because the, like you could turn the wick up and I got her around Christmas and or I don't know I like she was in well dolls are always Christmas so um, but I think I had her before Christmas because I was playing with the lantern and it was just like that just totally reminded me of that being able to turn up the wick how cool that was uh, you know, just such a nice little attention to detail. Even like just that's not functional, but having that feels really like, okay, cool. Whoever made this like knows how to work a sewing machine. Fun. Cute. All right. Uh, there she is, Miss Vicky B with her comb. And just for a last little look at our girl, soon to be entirely redressed, hair redone, just, you gorgeous girl, do you love some, do you love these little heels? Yeah, overall, just so impressed. Great job, great job, high five. Thank you for your licking approval. Well, y'all, if you want to see more unboxing videos, nails when I finally get my ass in gear, more restyles, the dollhouse that is coming, which I have been having way too much fun, wallpapering, and I may not own property, but I have a dollhouse. So that's pretty exciting. And of course, Tegan has little beds in every room. We are going to unveil that as it gets completed. Um, you can follow me on Instagram at ganja, claws un or ganja underscore claws and follow and subscribe here on the YouTube. Um, for more also puppy content, who doesn't want to see more of this slither princess? Hmm. And uh, yeah, whatever fun arts and crafts I get up to, you will be the first to know right here in the Ganja Claus Dwell House. Happy dwelling, darlings.